Monday shop talk, everybody. I got nothing, man. I got nothing. My head is throbbing. I told y'all I was going to start painting today. I was all excited about it, and I did. I started at 8 o'clock, and I finished at 3. And I stopped once at 10 to have me a little lunch for about 15 minutes and got back at it. The weather was perfect for uh, painting, although it was super hot. I'm at 101 degrees right now. But on that, when that sun came out on that on the side of the house, wow, I had I finished that up and then I thought I'd hit a, a, a shady side that I hadn't planned on. I only planned on doing the one side I got done. But, but me, you know me, keep on going. So I've got nothing. I got no content at all, except I will tell you a little follow up. A lot of times, those that know that I do my scales, I always the next day have to tweak them or somewhat. I don't have to tweak this at all. Okay, this morning, I welled away. I should have videoed it. That would have been some content. Uh, I whacked away at uh, some uh, brush over there by the fence. And I just wanted to get the feel of it. It feels great. Now, I just want to throw it. Although, at the same time, I don't want to mess up my new board. Because <laughs> these machetes and axes, uh, they do, they chew them up. They, it chews up my board. It really does. But, fortunately, that board there is uh, a lot less expensive to make and a lot faster to make. So, I can knock those out. It's just that one's so perfect. I got the perfect 4x4 four four post as far as knots going in it. Okay? So, the follow-up on this, this is the custom micarta scales on my SOG Safari Tonto Machete. Those of you that didn't see what had happened, uh, I was throwing uh, three machetes, SOG machetes, and the SOG Kukri sliced off the rubberized handle. So instead of spending $25 on a new one of these, which is budget friendly, I spent $25 on my car to scales, and it's smaller. Uh, it's not lighter, it's just smaller and it handles well. It's like, it was like the weight was forward and didn't do any, uh, I didn't have to work hard on my hands, you know what I mean? Okay, now, I did, I was smart on one thing. When I got started this morning, I ran back in and put it up. Just the first day since I got it, that I didn't carry my Buck 112 Ranger Sport the one with micarta, yep. I didn't want to get any paint on my micarta. And I don't want to stop every time and wash it off with soap and water every time I did. So I kept it inside. And it was a good day. This is what I got yesterday. This is that budget-friendly BK40 K-Bar folding knife. Okay? And it worked great. I had to, I had to use it several times. And... I did get paint on it, but it has that GFN scales and just wiped it off right away. But I was talking with uh, one of our Blade Brothers, Chris, not talking with him, we're messaging back and forth. These are the leftover scales, leftover from the scales that I made for the Safari. Check this out. Yep, that's what I'm thinking about. This is that GFN, which is no big deal. It's kind of like they have a, I have a uh, couple of TDIs that they that they have, uh, and it's that same material. It's like slick, but I'm thinking about putting. Uh, this might be another project. I'm not can give an honest uh, update on this because it's the first day I used it. I had a really nice subscriber ask me to let him know how it worked out and that he was interested in purchasing it. So I will let you know, buddy. Uh, this was the first day. I actually pried some uh, caulk out with the tip and nothing, nothing was happening. Cleaned off great and... 
flipping it open a lot better than when it comes out of the package. So that's cool. And that's the uh, K-Bar BK40 Becker folding knife. That's what I got yesterday. This is my first day using it. Okay, I got nothing. Sorry, guys. I have nothing, nothing, nothing. I do have a mail call coming Thursday, I believe. And I'm kind of excited. I got me a, a perfect knife that these will go to. So that's kind of cool. I spent $25 and was able to do this. And I'll be able to do another uh, fold. I will tell you guys, I'm not spraying my paint. I'm old school. I'm doing a nice rolling. Okay, this is a wooden house. I have siding and I have horizontal boards, tongue and groove. And let me tell you, this right rotator cuff right here, I'm feeling it. I had to be very careful and I'm feeling it. And what happens is start start feeling it right here and all through here. So we'll see what happens tomorrow. I just gotta keep going though. Uh, so I won't be throwing. I won't be throwing. It's 101, 101 degrees right now out there, so I'm not going to do it. Okay. I hope y'all had a good Monday. I hope you have a restful evening. And hopefully I can get back uh, kind of a routine where I can do some videos, throw knives, and show some knives. Okay. Y'all take care and sog out.